you'll want to learn to master your needle threader so sewing and embroidery is a lot smoother and faster. Another reason you want to use your needle threader, it's also a way to check to make sure that your needle, when you last put it in, got inserted high enough. So if it ever doesn't come up and line up with the hole of the needle, that should be clue number one that maybe we need to double check, did this needle get high enough? So the needle threader, as you can see, I'm gonna pull it down with my finger. And if I take my thread and kind of catch it about halfway down, I wrap it around this little hook here, then just bring it all the way down and then rotate it to the eye of the needle. It's coming in from the back side. With a little pressure I'm keeping on this thread, I'm gonna bring it in all the way into this little groove here on the side, and then I lift up just a little bit. That way the little hook can kind of pull it through to the back side. Now, I have to let go of this hand because if you hold on to this too much, then it can't pull that loop through to the back. So let me do that again. So halfway down, catch it, swoop it underneath, then push your left hand down all the way and rotate it to the needle. Then take your right hand, lip, push it all the way in and then up just a little bit and relax so it can pull it right on out. I'm just at the wrong angle here, there we go. And then that is the loop that you're gonna pull right on through. If you need a little extra room, you can always lower down that presser foot to help you use that needle threader. But it is wonderful. It can get bent, so it, just be really gentle with it. If it's not lining up, your uh, Husqvarna Viking dealer can adjust that and make it line up perfectly. So it is a huge time saver.